Now remember, if you take a select from the front or from the back, the chains are hooked up here. What do we have? We have a nice shoe. We have a nice shoe. Now, remember what I asked you about hooking to the corners. As this comes up, where is this going? It's going away from us. At a point where we get level, at a point where we get level, at that point now it's got to start doing this, sliding it towards us. With these straps, and the way this is, it's got to overturn. It's got to stand up. Is the tractor coming up? Hold on one second, Charlie. Okay. The reason why I'm asking you this, if you pay attention to that block of wood, that block of wood that's in there, if anybody looks on that side, did that block of wood push that tractor over? Watch the back of that. It sure did. That wood is tight, and it's pushing it over. Go ahead, Charlie. Catch line off. There you go. Because if you keep the catch line tight, what's going to want to do is want to drag you. Again, we'll the same thing again. Look, we've got that complete U still. The tractor kicks over. Let the catch line down, Charlie. You don't even have to go up on the straps. Catch line has that big. Don't even go up on the straps, Charlie. Let off on the straps. Run right off on the straps. You know, a 40 ton unit, I can tell you, there's a lot of guys that run 40 tons that do better than the guys with the 60 tons. And if, if that doesn't make it clearer, and, and whether it be actions 40 tons, 30, 40 tons, I mean, it doesn't get much sweeter than that.